So yeah, we are started. So welcome back and welcome to the fifth episode of season Photoshop. So in this episode, we are not going to create any artwork. We are not. So instead of that, we are going to create some cool profile pictures for you guys so that you can upload it on your Instagram or LinkedIn or any other social media. So why? Why are we doing this? Why are we creating these profile pictures? Why a particular episode for profile pictures only? So I'll share my personal experience. So what happens is that when I scroll through profiles, when I look for some people, when I look for professional people, I open profiles which have good profile picture, which have attractive profile pictures and professional profile pictures. So that's why we are here and that's why this episode is uh, being shot and let's get started. Let's make some cool profile pictures for you. So let's open Photoshop. Photoshop. Okay, so... Opening, go opening, opening, and opening. Can't wait, can't wait, can't wait. So, guys, so our profile picture is square. Actually, it's circle in some social medias, it's square. So, what we'll do is we'll take a square res, I'll take 1080 by 1080 and 72 resolution and 16 bit of colors so okay name your project file and let's get started so we are here with the blank artboard <laughs> so what i did is i already download one guy picture one, one guy picture he's indian and yeah just imported that picture here and here we are so the main thing I'll, I'll show you some profile pictures which I see normally on my Instagram and I'll tell you uh, design perspective and you can go through the people who they follow they have really cool profile pictures so you can see this orange, pink, yellow, red, blue, then red, and then it's me. <laughs> then blue is there, then green is there. So a lot of creative profile pictures are there on the internet. So we are gonna create something like that. So we are here with this guy. We are here with this guy. And normally we'll create a square profile picture and social medias automatically crops it and make it so good so in this episode i'm going to teach you a new method of cropping so be serious so take pen tool i use this tool when uh, there is not much of detailing we don't need detailing and all so in this episode we are not mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so we are gonna start i'll tell you how it works so this is pen tool and some people ask me why not pen tool so it's my personal choice actually i i use razor to crop my objects and i don't use pen tool because uh I'll, I'll show you the difference between eraser and pen tool so if i uh, select eraser and erase some part so it is showing me exact pixels which are being erased and if i go to pen tool and select some portion i'm not able to see what pixels are selected what are not you see the difference here i can see the pixels here i cannot and when i make selection then i'm able to see the pixels so i i don't like 
cropping with <laughs> pen tool so but for now for now we don't need much of detailing so we we'll use pen tool because it's a small uh, sized image we don't uh, need a detail cut of this guy so select your pen tool it's here you have pen tool and change it will be on shape but change it to path so just start drawing like this like this like this and go on i'll fast forward this process and let's meet after the selection don't uh, detail cut this guy because we don't want uh, that we can crop a lot of detail because it's a profile picture no one will open your profile picture and even social medias don't allow you to open someone's profile picture so don't care about the details so go on i'll crop mine and you can crop yours and we are done so once you select uh make a selection then right click and select on make selection so this value should be zero now select and keep in mind that whenever you are working with selection or anything you can't edit your selection with pen tool so go on select that uh, selection tool and right click and select inverse and press delete so we are already we have already cropped our image so that is done so we are here now second thing is setting a background for that you can uh pick any color and uh, like if i if i choose okay i'll take yellow so i i pick yellow color and i'll just press command and delete by uh so i'll press command and delete and with selecting so i'll select background layer and press command and delete So we are already there. We have created a good profile picture for our social media already. So to add on, like you can add it more. You can add it. You can always do a better job. So you can either. I'm I'm telling you this is the basic. You can change color. You can try different colors. But your basic, your profile picture is ready. You can you can use this as your profile picture. It looks professional. It looks amazing it looks cool it, it it is attractive and you can change color you can try colors whichever you like you can uh, keep your theme color of your social media or something i'll keep here yellow because it's looking good on yellow so another thing you can do is you can give your character a stroke so double click on the layer not on the name but on the side so double click on that layer and stroke you don't see anything but there is a line i tell you make it 10 so this is what i'll at it i'll keep it for outside so yes so make it 20 yeah this looks good so your profile picture is ready <laughs> it's that simple you can make cool profile pictures in just 5 minutes and it looks cool it looks professional and 
somebody will actually scroll through and it will they they will open your profile first because it looks attractive and it gives a hint that you you are serious about your social media so here is a 5 minute effort and you guys can create that too so go on create your profile pictures see you in next episode